SMU has pulled off the upset special four times this year, beating ranked teams. And we are underway with the Cardinal getting the first point of the match. Well, if this were last year, it would be a Pac-12 AAC matchup. Instead, both in the ACC this year. On the attack was Kurt denied by that SMU block. Here is Maya Tabron, one of the numerous transfers on this veteran SMU squad, sliding over Francis on the attack. Great SMU coverage. keeps it alive. Natalie Purdue, who provided instant energy late in that kick match, and there is the block by Nate D. Okamore. Last week named ACC Defensive Player of the Week. Minor swooping in on the attack was Kerr denied. That one kept alive by Oglevy. <laughs> Purdue was there at the net for SMU. Career. Here's Elena Oglevy. Cullen. Well, how about Natalie Foster transferred over from Wichita State? Up the program right now from where we were, it was easier to get talented transfers than it was to get kids out of high school. That one dug out high off of Tabron and the point for Stanford. Stanford's point, the ball hit the Jumbotron. That's a downside of having a really low Jumbotron is that you can't play off. SMU, but right now it's been all portal power for the Mustangs. That one dropped in there nicely by Natalie Foster. Cullen a few years ago was a starter at Michigan State, left that program to join a rebuilding SMU team. And it has paid off big time. A point for Stanford. Minus 050. Monster attack opening set in their win against Pitt. It doesn't get any better than this play. Ruben going all the way, but it starts with Kimmy Minor set in that. Minor more than 4,400 career assists and counting. Tabron diving attempt by Ogilvy kept it in play. Oh, pancake delivered by Shamay for SMU. Bodies flying all over the place. Teams going at it here in the opening set. There's the former Pac-12 libero of the year, Oglevy with the serve, hammered in the block by Foster. Somehow it's still alive, but now Stanford pulling away up 23-20. Serena coming alive here in Dallas. That one absolutely blasted by Maya Tabron. Such a low set, forcing that quick and leaving that line wide open. Cammy Miner not able to get her. Formerly with Colorado. Foster with that lethal serve. And nearly got her first ace of the night. Free ball for SMU. Cullen. Tabron again with authority. SMU within one. Here, Tabron making contact with that ball. The slap is so loud. That is showing you the work. In the opening set for Stanford. Off the tape, and there is an ace to end the set. Despite seven service errors in the opening set. Natalie Foster serving to begin set number two, leading the ACC in aces. There is Francis with the opening point of the set. Richard Freshman out of Istanbul, Turkey, having an impact early tonight. That one swatted down and terminated. Um, Wheeler right in the middle, the outside of the line, and that's because she credits Colin to her success of over a thousand kills so far. We've been serving. Cullen. Jamey denied by the 6'6 middle blocker, Sammy Francis. First set, and how she makes her arms reach over. She wasn't really close to minor, but she used... Stanford in the ACC. They're in the midst of a week-long road trip. They'll stay here for a few more days and then head to Pittsburgh. And the Stanford block showing up tonight in Dallas. Transfer from Creighton, who was voted a captain for being on the team for just a few months. Shows what kind of an impact she has. Speaking of impacts, Epar Kurt. Here is Naya Shimei, senior opposite out of Wyoming. Minor. 
That one smashed by E. Parker. Here is Celia Cullen, the senior setter. Miter. And Francis earns the point for Stanford back up by one. Eight blocks on the night for SMU, helping them go on a 3-0 run. Mustangs by two, pushed over by Francis. Here comes Jamison Wheeler. Francis with the point for the Cardinal. On the net. This was not a tight set, but Miner still knows where Francis needs that ball and making it easy for Francis to literally run this ball down. Offense has picked up in this set. Both teams hitting over 300. That one off the video board. Miner. And the point by E. Parker. I just dropped my thumb, lift my pinky. This ball will go straight down across in front of the 10 foot line. Great vision, seeing there's only one. We know what you'll see here to watch the Mustangs at home. Stanford hanging on by one here in set number two. Cami Miner. E. Parker to in the block, and she is fired up. 75 career aces. And backs up Tabron. Free ball on the way for Stanford. Up by two in the middle. Set point on the way for the Cardinal. It's a free ball. That libero better be the one to pass right on Cami Myers' head, making it the easy decision to run that fast tempo offense through Lizzie Andrew, leaving no blockers able to set up straight against her. Trying to see her team rally here late in the second. Set point for the Cardinal. In the middle, Foster keeping SMU alive in set number two. SMU looking for their first ace of the night. Miner. That one off of Tabron. And Stanford will grab set number two, 25-23. And take a two sets to nothing lead here in Dallas. Cullen flying in, Tabron meeting the Stanford block, and the Cardinal pick up where they left off. After review, the call was reversed. The ball was in, point Stanford. Remember, Kevin Hambly had a huge challenge late in the first set. High school in California serving for Stanford. Shimei, that one deflecting off of Kawa for the point. Back to her time playing for Creighton. Rubin on the attack. Tabron was there. On the other side, Jordan Harvey. Tabron took something off of it. Harvey off the block. Miner. From the back row, the point by Elia Rubin. From behind the 10 foot line, Stanford really hasn't utilized the back row attack too much, keeping that in their pocket. I like Kemi Miner going with that back row action to Ruben. That's how SMU goes. Does not want to let her get hot and get on a run. Miner. Kurt off of Purdue. Just saving it. Tabron. But that one all out of sorts. And again, Stanford pulling within one. He's been one of the best hitters in the nation over the last two years. Coming up big there. Flying in his curb, denied by the block, and that one dropping just out of bounds. Trying to touch those hands shows you how smart of a hitter she is. Stanford has tied it up at 19. This is breaking momentum for After Stanford. After review, the call is confirmed. Wow. Point Stanford. Ruben serving. Cullen. Sliding over Francis on the attack. Cullen with the dig. Free ball for the Cardinal. Golden opportunity. Kirk with the point. And match point on the way for Stanford. Such a deceptive outside right of your screen. Watch her pause her arm midair. Right there. Her hand stops, her arm stops. High off Wheeler. Jamison Wheeler on the attack. SMU not dead yet. Joust. Cullen just sends it over. 
And set point for the Mustangs, down two sets to nothing. And SMU, well, hold on, it was touched. Minor, the two-time All-American. That one was headed well out of play. Instead, Stanford ends up with the point. All-American for the match. Foster in the middle. Oglevy. Tapped over. Here's Shimei with the point. This is unreal. <laughs> it truly does not get any better than what we've seen over the last few minutes here in Dallas. One ace on the night. Team high 11 kills. Tapped over, reaching for that one was Cullen. Shimei waits for it and just pushes it over. Here is Ruben into Foster in the SMU block. Matt set point, must take to take set number three. Foster with the block, which I'm sure Shimei is a brain that happened. For the umpteenth time, match point Cardinal. Tabron. Here's Epar Kurt. Okamore nearly saved the day, but the point continues. Cullen. Here comes Okamore. Dug out by Ruben. Kurt took something off of it. Kurt off hands, and there it is. An epic third set ends with a Stanford sweep.